there's a bright spot of rainbow colors in the sky, but it's not raining. It's next to the sun. In fact, there's one on each side of the sun. What is that? Its nickname is Sun Dog because it follows the sun the way a dog follows a person. It is also called a mock sun because it imitates the sun and sometimes seems just about as bright. The technical name is parhelion if there's one or parhelia if there are two. That's Latin for with the sun. You'll frequently see sun dogs with a halo around the sun, but they happen without one too. It's a distant cousin of a rainbow. To get a sun dog, you need to have cirrus clouds, which are very high and very cold and made of ice crystals. The ice crystals separate the light into seven colors. That's called refraction. Most people don't notice because the sun is bright and you're not supposed to look directly at it. But if you shield your eyes from direct sunlight and look around the sun on a day with cirrus clouds, you can see a sun dog. This happens in all seasons and in all places on Earth as long as you have cirrus clouds. The refraction is the same as what you get when light passes through glass, and the glass separates it into the seven colors of the spectrum. By the way, many people take a picture or video of sun dogs and then notice a strange dot in the image. Right here, that thing dancing around is not a UFO. It's the reflection of the sun inside the glass of your smartphone's camera lens. When the camera moves, the dot moves. You'll get that dot whenever you point your camera at a very bright light, whether it is the sun, the moon, or even a light bulb in a room. See how the dot disappears when you get out of the direct sun? Sun dogs are pretty and interesting and common. They simply tell you the clouds are high, thin, and cold enough to be made of ice crystals. I'm meteorologist Alan Seals.